Hey, hey, hey. Hey, wake up! You all right? Yeah, more or less. Looks like this ain't no dream. Gah, what's going on? Hey, let us out of here! I know there's someone out there! Damn it! Where are we? Is this some kind of TV set? What the hell was that just now? Whoa, 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 whoa! You're shitting me, right? God dang. Come on, man. This is real bad. Yeah, you're telling me, man. Isn't there some way out of here? Come on, we gotta do something! Uh. Okay, I'll improvise. I got a plan. We talk to the barrels. They must know a way out. Hey. Yo, there's nothing in there. God, all right. Maybe we'll talk to the wall with chains. Uh... Hey, those chains are used for like torturing and stuff, right? Maybe, maybe they're not. Just ain't funny, man. Uh. God dang, how do you think I feel? Hmm. I go to sleep and I'm in jail and I come to school and I'm still in jail, dude. This sucks. Doesn't make any freaking sense. Yeah, that too. Hear that? Uh oh. That doesn't sound good. Be glad that your punishment has been decided upon. Your charge is unlawful entry. Thus, you will be sentenced to death. Say what? No one's allowed to do as they please in my castle. Huh? Wait. Is that you, Kamoshida? I thought it was some petty thief, but to think it'd be you, Sakamoto. Are you trying to disobey me again? It looks like you haven't learned your lesson at all, huh? And you brought a friend this time, because you can't do anything for yourself. This ain't funny, you asshole! Is that how you speak to a king? It seems you don't understand the position you're in at all. Not only did you sneak into my castle, you committed the crime of insulting me, the king! The punishment for that is death. It's time for an execution! Take him out! Stop it! God damn it! I ain't down for this shit! Come on, we're out of here! Just go! Get out of here! These guys are serious! Oh, running away, are we? What a heartless friend you are! He ain't a friend! Come on, hurry up and go! What's the matter? Too scared to run away? <laughs> Pathetic scum isn't worth my time. I'll focus on this one's execution. Take this! Yeah. Lowly yeah. scum! Use the best! Where'd your energy from earlier go? A peasant like you isn't worth beating. I'll have you killed right now. <laughs> what? Don't you dare tell me you don't know who I am. That look in your eyes irritates me. <laughs> Hold him there. After the peasant, it's his turn to die. No. No, I don't want to die. <laughs> <laughs> 
This is truly an unjust game. Your chances of winning are almost none. But if my voice is reaching you, there may yet be a possibility open to you. What's the matter? <laughs> are you simply going to watch? Are you forsaking him to save yourself? <laughs> Death awaits him if you do nothing. Was your previous decision a mistake then? Very well. I have heeded your resolve. Bow to me. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou who art willing to perform all sacrilegious acts for thine own justice. Call upon my name and release thy prey. Show the strength of thy will to ascertain all on thy own. Though thou be chained to hell itself! Execute him! What was that? You desire to be killed that much? Fine. <laughs> resides within you. If you so desire, I shall consider granting you the power to break through this crisis. Hmm. Very well. Who the hell are you? Guards! Start by killing that one! You'll learn the true strength of my men! Detest the enemies before you. Change that animosity into power, and unleash it! God dang, I've been waiting for this. The time's finally come to unleash our persona. And you can activate your persona by pressing the triangle button. And whether the attack is physical, or magical. It'll eat up HP or SP, respectively. God dang. <laughs> yes, it's named IHA. Let's unleash our attack! Heck yeah! God, that looks sick. But we didn't kill him yet. Swing your blade! But when you don't want to use your persona, melee attacks are the perfect thing. They don't cost anything, and do physical damage no matter what. So they're the perfect thing for finishing off foes. This power of mine is yours! Kill them however you want. Run wild to your heart's content! Words cannot even describe how amazing this awakening scene is. Like, 
Oh my gosh, Atlas outdid themselves again. How do they keep doing it? But <laughs> anyways, the battle's over, and now we've leveled up. God, your EXP even gets added to your wanted poster. This game is a league all its own, man. What? What was that just now? You little... Ha! You like that, you son of a bitch? Y you mean this? Okay, it's locked. Damn you! Hey, what was that just now? And your clothes? Whoa, it went back to normal. <laughs> you bastards! This is effing nuts! Anyways, let's scram! You lead the way! Goddamn thieves! After them! Don't let them escape! Holy crud, that was sick. And, uh, how you liking your cell, Kamoshida? You think you can get away with doing this to me? Yes, I don't give a crap, ain't down for any of this. Come on, let's get out of here. All right, man, but was it a smart idea to throw the keys in the... Well, that probably might have been helpful for later. All right, um, so let's focus on getting out of here and... Crap, they broke the bridge. I guess because Kamoshida's so fat, you like, I don't know. Oh, bridge. Looks like it broke, though. Wait, think we can jump across? I sure hope so. Yeah, according to the tutorial, we can. Cool. Man, that looks really cool, and... Well, we're gonna be using that a lot. Also, a little tip. If you hold down the X button, you don't have to press it every single time, and... I might as well show you this right now, because we're gonna see it eventually. So just keep your eye on, uh, Ryuji real quick. You coming, man? Oh. Yeah, he doesn't actually have an animation, but... Alright, so, moving on. Abusing, uh, lack of animations later. We gotta get out of here, and... Uh, this looks like the only way. Yeah, we're Zelda now, boys, and crap, my bag's stuck. Wait, what? Man, Ryuji, you're not even in the. T He's a freaking liar, man, and. Yeah, let's keep going, god dang. I don't know about you, but this music makes it so tense. God dang, I'm not gonna lie, I kinda like Ryuji's voice actor a whole lot. Heck, if I had his voice, it was probably way more entertaining, but. Hey, hold up! Look, there's some guys in armor over there. i probably call for backup if we try and take them out. Just go some other way. Alright. Good idea, actually, so... Jeez. My heart is pounding so much. I still can't get over that awakening scene, and... Is this a drawbridge? Yeah. I don't know what else it would be. Heck is this place? Dude, I don't know, man! I know about as much as you do, and... Hey, we gotta hide! Wait, why? Oh. It's a good thing we didn't go down that way, right? Jeez. What a... Kinda stunk. Over there. They're looking for us, right? Playing with this anymore. We gotta find a way to get this goddamn plate. I'm working on it, Ryuji. J chill, man. Just gotta keep going forward. And <laughs> hopefully, not run into more guards, even though this is a castle. And the entire purpose of a castle is to protect the king. And they're kinda not doing their job, huh? And is this the exit? <sighs> hey, let's get the heck out of this plate. Alright, man. After you. I mean, I'm not attached to it any more than you are. But something tells me it's not gonna be easy getting at it. Yeah. Dude, you gotta be joking. This ain't the exit. The heck is this place? I don't know, man. When I came here yesterday, there was not a medieval dungeon and... Hey, look. We really did hear people screaming. So we ain't the only ones who got captured. Is... Is he okay? Uh, he doesn't look okay, man. Yeah, they're stuck in cages. Oh my god. They even have helmets. Ugh. That's all kinds of creepy. But we gotta worry about ourselves right now. What the hell? Another dead end. Yeah, we're getting really unlucky, aren't we? Dang it. The heck are we supposed to get out of here? Hey. Blondie! Frizzy hair! Look over here. Wait, what? Um. Uh, what is this thing? You're not soldiers of this castle, right? 
Get me out of here! Look, the key's right there! We're trying to get the hell out of here. I mean, you obviously look like an enemy too. I'm locked up here, so how can I be your enemy? Help me out! I am not a cat! Say that again and I'll make you regret it! They're catching up already! Shit, there's still no service. Ain't there any way to contact someone outside? How the hell do we get out? Hey, you too! Wanna know where the exit is? Let me out, and I'll take you there. You don't want to get caught and executed, right? I'm not lying. It's the truth. This thing sounds like it's all talk. If you guys think you can get out on your own, then be my guest. What do we do? Are you seriously not messing with us? If you don't hurry, they'll catch you. Fine. Uh, uh, freedom tastes so great. Now where's the exit, you monster cat? Don't call me a cat. I am Morgana. Shut up and hurry it up. You want to be locked up again? Oh, all right. Sheesh. Follow me and stay quiet. What? Jeez. It's fourth period already. Sakura-san said that Kurusukun left the house this morning. Should I contact the police? Uh, probably. There's a child missing. That's kind of a problem. No, I'll just be more of a hassle. What? What did I do to deserve this? Your student doesn't show up to class and you just... Just saying. I'm gonna call the police in that scenario, because we're kind of stuck in a dungeon after all, and I guess we just gotta follow it. Yeah, we don't have much of a choice, man, but well, this thing doesn't even know how to get out of here, but eh, maybe we can trust it. What the heck are you doing? Hey. I like this statue? Honestly, it's a little gaudy for my taste. What does it look like I'm doing? I'm lowering the bridge. Okay, how are we supposed to know that? And you, Frizzy here. Seems like you pick up on things faster than our blondie over there. Try checking around the mouth of the statue, okay? Alright, I can manage that. God, how it transfers from cutscene to... I love that so much. Anyways, yeah, we're gonna pull down on his mouth and lower the bridge. For real? Yeah, for real. How are we supposed to know to do that? <laughs> Amateur. Come on, let's keep going. <laughs> Oh shit! Oh shit, it's them! You amateur! Stay still! Hey you! You can fight, right? Let's go! Come! You got one of those things too? We will promptly shut them up! Damn shadows. They've taken up intercept positions. It means they're holding nothing back and are serious to kill us. I'll back you up. So fight like your life depends on it. Let's go! More enemies. And let's, uh, dispatch the bedside brute. Wow, that is actually hilarious. <laughs> I knew you were an amateur. This is how you fight! Zero, show your might! Strike at an enemy's weakness to knock them down. Use that opening to strike again! That's the most basic of basics. Remember it well! And now we're introduced to the main mechanic of Persona, exploiting enemy weaknesses for additional turns. This is something you will use for the entirety of the game, so make sure you remember it. However, just because the enemies have weaknesses doesn't mean that you don't. Come on, let's hurry and get through this! While we can't really showcase it too well here, knocking down your opponent and exploiting their weakness is pivotal to your success in Persona 5. So keep it in the back of your head. But yeah, 
We beat them both. And now it's time to level up. Heck yeah. Wow, we're already level three. It's actually kind of surprising. I wonder when our cat friend's gonna level up and... Wait, we already have a new skill? Sweet! That's actually pretty nice, because our strength stat's a little bit higher than our magic stat, so cleave in the long run. It'll be a little bit better for our hero, but... Yeah. The heck are these things? Who the heck are you? Not bad. Persona's pretty powerful. Uh, uh, thank you, I guess. Persona? Yeah, the thing that comes out of your guys all dramatic a lot. Yeah, that's a pretty good way of putting it. Yes. You saw how frizzy hair were ripped off his mask when you summoned it, right? Well, everybody wears a mask deep within their hearts. By removing that, we summon a persona. You turn back to normal. Hmm. Looks like you don't have full control over your power yet. The transformation shouldn't normally dissolve like that. After all. Uh... That's enough. This crap doesn't make any sense. Yeah, no kidding. Can't you just sit still and listen for once, Blondie? Don't call me Blondie! My, my name is Ryuji! Alright. Hey. God, these don't get along. Actually, there's no time for me to lecture you. You want to escape this place in one piece, right? Let's go! Alright. You're the one holding us up. Oh. But before that, take these. Use them carefully, okay? Alright, what... This cat just gave me drugs! Dude, thank oh. you! Come on. We should hurry. It's not much farther to the exit. Alright. Right behind you. Jeez. I'm actually really impressed how quickly they're just getting a lot of the game mechanics just out there for you. And just make sure your HP is good, okay? So a chance we'll end up having a fight in here. And yeah, you can press the square button to auto-recover, but we're not going to do that because we don't really have a lot of items right now. And, and view the tutorials in the tutorial menu. Cool. Are you glad you need a tutorial? Oh my god, this is so sick. I love the menus in this game. I'm probably going to be talking about them a lot, but uh... Yeah, let's check out our persona. God dang, Arsen. I love this design so much. I just... I could talk about it for this whole video, but that's probably dumb. So we're not gonna do that. Instead... Alright, so we're gonna use our, uh... SP from Morgana to heal, since I actually want to hold on to those items. And I recommend you do the same, but... God. Alright, we'll check out the menus a little bit later. For right now, we gotta get out of this school jail thing and... Not that way. The exit is over the... Hey, man. I saw a yellow rectangle on the... Wait, what the heck is this over here, then? Oh, my God. Uh... How long have these guys been in here? I don't know, but... Why are they even in jail? What do they do? Is everyone else here on probation? No, this is, like, way too severe for that. God. Something's up. And... Well, there's a loading screen, so you know what that means. Hold on a sec. What's up? Oh. I feel like I've seen what this dude's wearing before. Dang it. I'm too flustered. I can't remember a dang thing! Come on. Let's go. Yeah, we can worry about this later, Ryuji. Come on, man. Hold on, dang it! What did you say? What is it? We need to go fast! Yeah, we don't have time, man. But who are these guys? Do you really think you have time to worry about other people right now? Got a point, Ryuji. Besides, they're... There! Uh-oh. That's not good. <sighs> you should have just listened to me. Well, there's no way around it. We gotta fight. I'm glad you stick to your guns. Kinda have to at times like this, and... <sighs> looks like it's rare to go to. Oh, man. So we're starting the battle against the, uh... The Pixie! The game refers to it as something totally different, the Beguiling Girl, but if you've never played an Atlas game before, you definitely know who this is. And this enemy is actually weak to Aiha. And what you're supposed to do here is probably use the same attack against the other Pixie, but... Oh my gosh, that's so cool. I really want to show off Cleave and the fact that Arsene has swords on his feet. God dang, that's sick. Oh, sweet, Morgana Dodge! Nice! But yeah, there's just one left. Let's finish it off. And now we're on our way. God, I just... I can't even say it enough, guys. If anything, I'm holding back. Like, I could be doing these fights a whole lot faster, but since it's like, you know, that's a tutorial area, I don't want to go too fast, but... God dang, I love this battle system. Alright, let's get away before more show up. I'm okay with that. 
great idea. And hold on. We can't just leave these guys here. I think we have to, man. You really don't get it, do you? <sighs> There's no time to explain. Look, I'm going. If you don't want to follow, be my guest. My heart's in the right place, Ryuji, but dang it. Fine, I'm coming. Yeah, man, we can always come back for him. Right? Maybe we can't. Crud. It'll be okay, hopefully. The entrance hall's right above here. The exit's close. Keep it up! Oh my gosh, if that's true, then we're almost free. It's time to get the heck out of here. We're here! Oh, finally! We're saved! It's not opening! Did you trick us, you jerk? Don't jump to conclusions. Over here! Hey, wait up! Where are we supposed to get out from here? There aren't even any windows! Ugh, amateur. This is the most basic of basics. That's right. Everything's hopeless and black like my fur. Now, why would I die here with you two? The ventilation shaft, you morons. You guys should be able to squeeze through it one at a time. I see. Then we just gotta get that metallic mesh off. And a one, and a... Ah! Oh, crap. The enemy didn't hear us, did they? Seriously, we're finally getting out of here! You should wait on celebrating until you actually get out. Now get going! But what about you? There's something that I still have to do. We're going our separate ways. <laughs> you better be careful too. See ya. Those two seem useful. Especially the frizzy-haired one, if my judgment's right. <sighs> Did we make it? You have returned to the real world. Welcome back. Huh? Returned? Does that mean we got away? <laughs> I don't know what to think anymore. What was all that anyways? That castle and, and Kamoshida and that weird cat? What the hell's going on? What's with the yelling? Are you students of Shujin? Cutting classes, are we? Huh? No. We were trying to get to school and we ended up at this weird castle. <sighs> what? <sighs> Hand over your bag. You better not be doing any drugs. Why would you think that? Are you his friend? Then you should go to school. Take him with you. Like I'm trying to say, I don't know what's going on either. We passed by Shujin on our way here. There was nothing out of the ordinary about it. If you spout any more nonsense, I'll contact your school. Is that what you want? Come on, say something! Uh, that's not what I meant. W wait a sec! Is that guy for real? Fine, I'm going! Minister of Transport announcing his resignation. <laughs> Things are going as planned. Sai Nijima. That reminds me. <sighs> Better to leave it be for now. I'm sure we came the same way. I, what's going on here? That's exactly what I wanted to ask you. We received a call from the police. The damn cops snitched on us after all. Hmm. 
It's rare not to see you alone. Where were you roaming around until this time? Uh... A, ca a castle? So you have no intention of giving an honest answer. What's this about a castle? <laughs> Kamoshida? You seem so carefree, Sakamoto. Quite a difference from when you did morning practice for the track team. Shut up! It's your fault that it... How dare you speak that way to Mr. Kamoshida? <sighs> There's not much leeway left for you, you know? He's the one that provoked me! Do you really want to be expelled? In any case, you'll have to explain yourself. Follow me. What? This is bullshit! Come now. I should have been more considerate, too. Let's just say that we were both to blame. Well, if you say so. Still, you're coming with me. It's undeniable that you're extremely late. Fine. By the way, you're that new transfer student, correct? Have we met somewhere? That's right. I remember now. Well, I'll overlook this just for today. I'm sure you've heard from the principal. But cause any trouble and you'll be expelled. Understand? At any rate, Hurry up and go to the faculty office. I'm sure Ms. Kawakami's tired of waiting. Good luck trying to enjoy your new school life. The school turned into an old castle? A talking cat? Are you hallucinating from an overdose? I won't put up with you if you're simply joking around. I'm going to have you continue the story. The one who received a calling card from the Phantom Thieves was an Olympic medalist. An alumnus from Shujin Academy. The PE teacher Suguru Kamoshida. It's true that what he did were deplorable crimes from... indulging his desire. He confessed to it all. But there should have been no connection between the two of you since you had just transferred. Why did you target him? That's unacceptable. Try and recall it once again. What the heck? I honestly don't know what to make of this whole, like, flashback scenario. It's kind of strange, but... Eh, at least it's unique, but... Jeez, talk about bad first day of school. We didn't even show up for like half of it. That kind of sucks, but hey, at least we're not dead, right? And that guy does not look too pleased with me. And man, God, there's so much detail and everything. This is so sick. Even the schools. Oh man, I'm gonna love this game. I can already tell. Hi there, late middle-aged teacher. So you're that problem transfer student. Late on the first day, too? You like causing trouble for the sc- Uh, listen, man. There was a castle and a talking cat. I don't want to hear it. What's with that attitude? Show some respect. Do you want to be reformed? I mean, this is a sign of what you'll be like. Uh, no. Not really. Totally blowing things out of proportion, buddy. No. Wait, what is- Dude, look at that bro- Oh my god. Yo, I wish my school had that when I was in high school, god dang, and none of these breads look interesting to me. Are we looking at the same thing here? That looks pretty darn good. Anyways, I guess we'll check that out one day, and they even have the red bu Okay, I understand this is like a common thing in Japan, but... I'm just happy it's back. I missed you, giant red button. Anyways, we gotta head up to the faculty office. I really do want to check out, like... Like, everything. I know we've just sort of been, like, blazing through the exploration and stuff, but... We'll come a time where we get to check all that out and... Oh, what's going on here? I can't recommend you to the college anymore. We've suddenly decided on a different student. Oh, snap. What? You already promised to recommend me! 
I'm sorry, but you'll have to accept that this was decided by the school. Uh, they went to prioritize students from our highly acclaimed volleyball team. Volleyball team, huh? Hmm. Seems kind of random. Let's see what these guys are up to. Ugh. You really allow criminals into the high school? I don't want to go to school with someone like that. If he's still called a criminal if he's underaged, I guess all that matters is that he's dangerous. He's convicted of assault, right? A guy like that must be really scary looking. The school should kick him out already. It sounds like he's a time bomb just waiting to go. Listen, you little dork. That is half true, anyways, if you keep up. <laughs> no, not really. We're a good kid, right? But I think this is the... Yeah, it's definitely the faculty office. Guess it's time to tell our homeroom teacher why we were late. Ugh, unbelievable. Being over half a day late on your first day? Can you explain yourself? You can't be serious. Will you pull yourself together? You were given fair warning yesterday. More importantly, I heard that you were caught along with that Sakamoto kun. <sighs> Don't get involved with him, okay? He's nothing but trouble. He wasn't like that when he was devoting his time to track and field, though. Anyway, break's almost over. Classes will end after fifth period today because of the subway accident. I'll have you introduce yourself when class resumes. Follow me. By the way, when you introduce yourself, be serious about it even if you're lying to the class, okay? Do not say anything unnecessary. You think that's him? Huh? The one in the rumors? Being super late on his first day? He really is insane. He looks normal, though. But he might slug us if we look him in the eye. <sighs> Settle down. Well, I'd like to introduce a transfer student. Today we had him attend from the afternoon on since he wasn't feeling well. All right, please say something to the class. He seems quiet, but I bet when he loses it... I mean, he was arrested for assault, right? Uh, so... Your seat will be... Hmm, over there, the one that's open. Sorry, but can the people nearby please share your textbooks with him for today? Ugh, this sucks. <sighs> Lies. <sighs> Did you catch that? Mm -hmm. Do those two know each other? Ooh, does that mean he hit on her before transferring here? That means she's cheating on him with Mr. Kamoshida. Then again, this is Takamaki-san we're talking about. For real, that side of the room is totally awful. Oh right, the volleyball rallies in two days. Everyone's just changed classes, so make sure you use that time to get to know each other. Well then, let's get class started. Who's on duty today? Everyone, please rise. Hmm? What's wrong? Are you sure you're okay? Also, it seems like people are already talking about you, but I'm not the one who told them. I can't even catch a break. Why do I have to deal with this? You should head straight home without stopping by anywhere. Sakura-san sounded pretty angry. Oh, and about Sakamoto-kun, don't get involved. Speak of the devil. 
What do you want? I heard the police caught you cutting classes today. <sighs> it was nothing. And you haven't dyed your hair back to black, either. Sorry about that. I'll be waiting on the rooftop. <sighs> See? That's why I don't want you getting involved. Understood? Why didn't you allow a student like him to transfer here? He's already started associating with Sakamoto. A student with a criminal record and the culprit of an assault case? At this rate, it'd be pointless how much I contribute to the school. Now, don't be like that. This school counts on you, Kamoshiro-kun. You are our star. Still, a steady build-up is necessary behind such brilliance as well. Your troubles never seem to end, do they, Principal Kobayakawa? All right, I understand. I'll continue to do my best to answer your expectations of me. Kamato seems eager to meet you. Should probably head up to the rooftop. All right, I can manage that, but seriously, what's going on? This is so weird. And uh, hey, well, you don't look too good. Uh huh. Uh, is there something you want from me? Uh, not necessary. Well, I guess that would be helpful. You know, I get the roof, but nobody's allowed up there. Uh, I mean, just go to those stairs and you'll get there. Uh, thanks, man. Why is he all beat up and stuff? Someone bullying him on the first day of school? That's kind of ridiculous. And, uh, I guess this is like a major character or something. Hmm, what should I write about for the next paper? I wish there was a good topic out there. <laughs> well, hmm, you could write about that new transfer student. I hear he's devilishly handsome. <laughs> what, what, uh, you're talking about that one at the center of all those rumors online, right? Alcohol, smoking, theft, violence. The teacher would never approve of such an article. If I admit it's juicy. <laughs> Anyways, apparently, yeah. The rumors about us are just getting more preposterous as time goes. God dang. We just can't catch a break in this town, man. But, oh well, we just gotta deal with the cards we're dealt with. But, yeah. Been wasting enough time. We should probably head up to the roof and end up over Yuji. I'm pretty darn sure I know what he wants to talk about. It says off limits, but the door isn't locked. It's kind of weird. Oh well, let's go. There you are. Sorry for calling you up here like this. I bet Kawakami already told you stuff like, don't get involved with him, huh? <sighs> Figured as much. Then again, we're in the same boat. I heard you got a criminal record. Everyone's talking about it. No wonder you were so gutsy. What was all that that happened? You know, how we almost got killed at a castle. It wasn't a dream, right? You remember it too, yeah? Well, just because we both remember it doesn't mean much, though. I mean... Even if it was a dream, you saved me from Kamoshida. So yeah, uh, thanks. But man, that Kamoshida we saw there. You probably don't know about it, but there are some rumors about him. Yeah, the ripped mop head. That asshole who was all full of himself at the castle. No one says anything against him because he's some medalist who took the volleyball team to nationals. The way Kamashita was king of that castle felt crazy real because of that. I wonder if we can go back to that castle again. Ah, forget it. It must have all been a dream. It has to be. Sorry to drag you out here like this. That's all I had to say. You know, we might be pretty similar. I feel like we're gonna get along just fine as troublemakers. I'm Ryuji Sakamoto. I'll come talk if I see you around. Don't ignore me, alright? See ya. Huh. That Ryuji guy ain't so bad, but... Yeah, it can't be a dream if we both had it, right? 
Anyways, we gotta return home. But before we do that, I haven't saved in like an hour and a half. So, yeah. And Alright, now that we've taken care of that, it's time to head home. And man, talk about a rough first day of school. Like, it was raining on the way there. We fought life and death inside of a castle. And that doesn't even, that doesn't even account for all the homework Kawakami gave me. Like, seriously, ladies, it's the first day. I got an interesting call from your school today. Uh-oh. It's only your first day, and you're already showing up hours late? Listen, man. It was an accident. I'm sorry, but it's not gonna happen again, alright? Yeah. That's what everyone says. Jeez, this guy's cold. Look. Just behave yourself. Your life's forfeit if anything happens. You understand the meaning of probation, right? Yes. You told me yesterday. Now it's also our vocab word. Okay, then. Oh, is his wife calling? Hey, what's up? Yeah, just closed up shop. I'll be there in a half an hour. Oh, he seems happy. What is it? Hey, what are you standing around for? Go hurry up to bed. All right, man, gosh. No, just hired a part-timer. What the, all right. Yo. Don't forget to lock the door and turn all the lights off, okay? All right, man, no problem. Yep, I'm leaving now. I told you. He's a part-timer. Okay, just... Not gonna question that, but jeez, man. Come me a break. I mean, I know you gotta be strict and all because I'm on probation, but... Well, I guess he doesn't really know what happened there. Heck, we don't even know what happened there. Why is the school, like, turned into a castle? I feel exhausted. Maybe it's because of all that weird stuff that was happening to me today. Yeah, probably. Maybe I'll just forget about it. We head off to bed. About time you've come to! On your feet, inmate! Our master wishes to speak with you. It's for your own sake that you take his words to heart. First off, let us celebrate our reunion. Oh, you've awakened to your powers, and special ones at that. Your rehabilitation can finally begin. There is no need to understand it all for the time being. You will be training the power of Persona, which you have awakened to. Personas are, in other words, a mask, an armor of the heart when confronting worldly matters. I have high expectations for you. There is no need to worry. You will learn when the time comes. By the by, have you come to appreciate the Metaverse Navigator? Using it will allow you to come and go between reality and palaces. I bestowed it to you as a means to train you as a thief. The Metaverse Navigator is a gift from our master. You better take care in using it, inmate. Devote yourself to your training so that you may become a fine thief. It must be disheartening to make use of the Metaverse Navigator alone. Should there be others who would prove beneficial to you, I will grant it to them as well. This is all for you to grow as a most excellent thief. <laughs> it's time. Go back and enjoy whatever rest you might have. Metaverse Navigator, huh? I had another strange dream. Yeah, that's putting it lightly. If I'm being honest. Fate. Awakening. What is this fire emblem? Alright, dumb jokes aside. More importantly, I need to hurry and get ready for school. But yeah, I guess the Metaverse Navigator makes it sound like that place didn't... Like, like it always existed. And now we're just being able to see it, but... Anyways. The sign's turned. It's time to head to school and... What was the conductor thinking? 
Trying to go to station at top speed like that? Didn't you hear? The guy totally lost it. It's been happening a lot lately. What the heck? All these accents are because people are suddenly losing their minds, right? Sounds like it'd be a way bigger deal if that was the case. Well, between the economy sucking and how depressed the news always is, it's not all that surprising. I beg to differ, people losing their minds over the news? Huh. Maybe it's more realistic than you think. Kind of makes you think of current events in a way, but... Anyways, that's none of my concern at the moment. For right now, we gotta be not late for school, because if we're late two days in a row... God dang, for a Japanese high school student, that's that's basically like breaking every rule in the book. We're not going to have that, but yet again, two rainy days back to back. and you know, There's some girls hanging out. Let's eavesdrop a bit. Feels so down when it's raining. Guess you're playing volleyball in the gym for P.E. today. I'm not looking forward to that. Why do I have to be on the same team as Takamaki? She's only a magazine model because of her stupid, ridiculous body. Being near her disgusts me. Yeah, but we can't just ignore her either. Because of what happened with your Kamoshida. Dealing with her is such a hassle. I wish she'd just not come to school. That is such a me- Oh my god. Jealous? God, does not even a begin to describe it. Alright, well. Can't really do too much about that. Because they were eavesdropping and all. And I seem to have made her school safely. What about that castle? Yeah. I guess that's the next big mystery, huh? But schoolwork comes first, I guess. Class is starting. I'm the social studies teacher, Mr. Ushimaru. Be teaching the rules of society this year. Cool, man, and <laughs> you look like you've been spoiled growing up. Before we learn society's rules, maybe I should start with the rules of being a decent human being. Hey, new kid. Hi. A great philosopher Plato divided the human soul into three parts. What's the answer? A soul is comprised of appetite, spirit, and what else? So this is the first question we're asked in Persona 5, where our choice actually matters, but the answer here is logic. And if you answer this correctly, you get some points. <laughs> Thanks. So, you know that, huh? Plato's teacher, Socrates, said that evil is born from ignorance. People who have been babied, thought that evil is due to individuality, and only become society sc Okay, man, and... Wow, he got it right. He's really a delinquent. Seems like a punk, but... He's actually serious about studying. I feel like a lot smarter now that you answer the qu- <laughs> You could just guess and you'd get smarter- Whatever, that doesn't make much sense, but... We'll get a point in one of our five stats. This time, knowledge. So, throughout the game, we're going to slowly but surely be working on all five of these stats. Because right. maxing them out is incredibly important for a 100% run, and bizarre incidents have been occurring frequently. Those are but the actions of such scum. We don't need crude people like that in this school, understood? I feel like this guy's projecting a little bit, or just talking directly to me. I don't know. Either way, he's a jerk. I got the question right. Who gives a crud? School's over and hey there, Takamaki! Looking for a ride home? Things have been pretty dangerous lately, all those accidents. What the heck? Sorry, I have a photo shoot today. It's for the special summer issue, so can't afford to miss it. What is going on here? Hey now, being a model's fine and dandy. But don't work your pretty little self to the bone. You mentioned you weren't feeling well, right? Something about appendicitis? Uh, how would you even know that? Yeah, I keep planning to go to the hospital, but I've been too busy. Sorry to worry you. You must be lonely, too. I feel bad for keeping your best friend at practice so often. That's why I asked you out in the first place. Oh, and be careful around that transfer student. He's got a criminal record, after all. If something were to happen to you. Uh... Thank you. Uh, please excuse me. I'm right here, you jerk. God dang. <laughs> God. That makes me so incredibly uncomfortable, because I've actually witnessed something like that happen, and... Oh. But, were you just waiting for me to get out of school? But, either way, what's up, man? Let's talk about the castle from yesterday. I 
tried to tell myself it was all just a dream, but I couldn't do it. I can't act like nothing happened. It's all connected to that Kamoshida, after all. I want to find out what's up with that place, no matter what. And you know, you're the only person I can rely on for this stuff. So you in? Yeah, I guess I kind of have to be. I mean, can't let all those guys just be stuck in there forever, right? Oh. Looks like I managed to talk some sense into you. <laughs> Alright, I think we should try and retrace our steps from yesterday. Oh, good thinking, Ryuji. In the meantime, you're walking to the station, right? Let's go together. Let me know if you notice any other weird buildings on the way. Oh, you got it. Yeah, Ryuji doesn't seem like a bad guy. We should probably just go along with this. Yeah, I mean, come on. What's the worst that could happen? Other than getting sent in jail again and possibly executed. Huh, why are we doing this again? If a huge castle like that really exists, I'm sure we'll find it in no time. When did they build something like that, though? We walked that way from here, right? When you put it that way, I'm not so sure anymore. All right, this way. Let me know if you notice something. at school. There wasn't anything out of place along the way, right? I didn't see no castle either. Ah, we must have made a wrong turn somewhere. Let's try again. Come on, you gotta stick with me to the end. Let's go. For real? than we think it is? What do you think? I already did that. But I didn't see anything like it around here. Huh? Phone. Hey, that reminds me. Didn't you have a navigation app thingy on back then? I don't know if it was or not, but I heard stuff that sounded like one coming from your phone. You know, didn't it say stuff like, returned to the real world, or something like that? Let me see your phone for a bit. What's this eyeball looking thing? That's not how I'd describe it. What a weird app. Oh, wait, this is it! I knew it! It is a navigation app! There's even your search history! Aw oh man, I'm such a genius! Let's try using it. Why? All we're doing is starting an app. Kamoshida. Shujin Academy. Pervert. Castle. Beginning navigation. Here we go! And then we went in a certain direction and... Hey, what are you... Huh? What the hell? 